There are others now packing, cramming mementos into obese suitcases. They are looking for a new life, a new beginning, a job, a few euro. Family men and women, young boys and girls, children. They are coming, but they will not be welcomed. The only people pleased to see them will be their traffickers. They will be stuffed like squashed grapes into a vat. The airtight container will wrap around them like a monster's mouth. There will be no light for days. They will not see the ocean nor hear the seagulls. To them in the darkness, Dublin will indeed be a heaven, Grafton Street a wonderland. They will not experience Joyce's swerve of shore, nor bend of bay, nor see the environs. These are the ghost people. The invisible. Shh. Can you hear them? Fate holds them together, huddled in the hold of a ship. They are the recycled, the turned away, fodder, raw product for the only industry they have ever known, human cargo. They are the smuggled goods. The media will call them non-nationals, Eastern Europeans, Africans, aliens, refugees, migrants, asylum seekers, spongers. But I know them as Lithuanians, Bosnians, Romanians, Nigerians, Sudanese, Irish, Russian, my fellows. God knows them as his children as they are all arrested at the point of entry on East Wall. God and Becca think, try harder, try again. God loves a tryer, we all love a doer. They will now be escorted. Frog marks corralled onto chartered flights against their Bill of Rights. No mention of the UN Convention. Against their will and gods, they will be strapped in for take-off, taken away, the throwaway people for export, for deport, always on the go, on the lookout for a resting place, a halting site. For them, it will be return, return, return to sender. No address known. No passport, no ID papers to call their own. Destination unknown. They will tell of Irish eyes not smiling. The only people pleased to see them will be their traffickers. They are the goods in transit. Welcome aboard flight EU 2004. These people are not the movers and the shakers. They are the moved on, the shaken to the very, very core. Nothing to greet them but the cold, cold reception. They are the no paid, the constantly conveyor belted. From port to port, land strip from land strip, from detention center to detention center, prison to prison, horror to horror, passed on and over and over a lifetime, like a well palmed coin, always in motion, in their hearts, hope against hope, right shotgun, all they seek is a living. God blows his warm breath on them, 30,000 feet above, in a tin can they travel. The captain announces that today they all travel first class, but nobody understands his language. Everybody prays to the God of their choice for one last chance, for another go at the wall, at the frontiers, at the gates, at the borders. God says yes, the EU says no. We all would like another chance. But the only happy smiling faces that will greet them will be their traffickers, their smugglers, their slave makers. And the media, the media will call them non-nationals, foreigners, no-gooders, aliens. The media will call them spongers, lazy, wasters, layabouts, unwanted, criminals, dirt, moochers, lawbreakers, job robbers. But I know them as my friends. I know them as my neighbors. I know them as my brothers and my sisters. I know them as my fellow human beings. <laughs>